All right, praise the Lord. Brothers and sisters, uh, just want to address uh, the Blessed Oak Chapel, our local fellowship here, as well as our live stream audience. Uh, some changes going on that are for the good. Uh, the government tried to clamp us down again, right? Because the whole COVID-19 thing. And we're like, you know what? The scriptures say, uh, it's okay. Hey, if we have to wear a mask, everybody's wearing masks for the most part. We'll try to do that. But guess what? When they're saying, hey, you can't fellowship again. The Bible says not to forsake the assembly of yourselves together, but to get together all the more you see the day of Christ approaching. And as things are getting darker and uglier, we don't want to be apart, right? We want to get together more and more and obey the scripture. So we're going to find one way or another to get together. And praise God, we're able to meet outside. Uh, but we're still doing live stream. So what we're going to do is our live stream uh, service will be our local Blessed Hope service in our parking lot. So all of our brothers and sisters from Blessed Hope, you can obey the scripture and not forsake the assembly of yourselves together. You can get into the word in the live stream audience, those of you that can't be here physically. But I encourage you, especially if you've been out of fellowship for some time, uh, that doesn't please the Lord if you can be in fellowship and you're out of fellowship. So I really want to encourage you because the Bible says in that same passage, when you're not supposed to forsake the assembling of yourselves together, that we're supposed to stimulate one another to love and good works. You can't do that. You can't be, you know, uh, encouraging each other if you're not around. So we're trying to facilitate that. And praise God, we have the outdoor service at nine o'clock. So for you late nighters and you early risers, we kind of compromise in between so you can all be here at nine where it's still pretty cool. And praise the Lord. Guess what? You don't need to wear a mask because we're going to be outside. Amen. So I want to really want to encourage you guys to be there. We're looking forward to it. Uh, we're like, how can we get around this man and us uh, and still be not broken up where we can't fellowship because that doesn't do us any good. And we found a way to be biblical. And at the same time, uh, we believe within the law. And if the law says, hey, you can't fellowship, we're still going to fellowship some way. We'd find another way. But right now we can all get together with all of our brothers and sisters which we haven't been able to do for some time. I mean, it was opened up for a while, so we were able to, but this is cool because you don't need a mask either. So we praise God for our live stream audience. Uh, just a little adjustment. That'll be airing at nine instead of at 10. So I have a little acoustic worship outside. Hopefully we're gonna try to pull all this off. Uh, the quality hopefully will still be good. We'll be shooting from a cell phone. We won't have the, all the camera angles and stuff, but it's not the camera angles that change you. It's the word of God that changes you, amen, and the power of the Holy Spirit. And it's be so wonderful to get together outside. And I like these adjustments because as things get dark in the world, we have to adjust. We have to pray and we have to navigate to stay in the word and stay together. And we're trying to do that the best we can. So thank you for your patience. We love you guys. And press on in Jesus and see you at nine this Sunday. God bless you.